Hey all desserts, welcome back to this damn mission. We still have another, another floater pack to take a look at, so I'm gonna bank on the fact, it's a terrible idea, but I'm gonna bank on the fact that Leif may reveal where they're hiding. If I just kinda get him on this wall here, he may still stay concealed, go through the door, give me a visual on the interior. So it looks like I've got no visual. They're out there, okay. So that's where they're at. The heavy floaters, such as they are, are over there. Which means I gotta reevaluate a little bit now how I wanna fight them. Zhang, I think I need to put here, for obvious reasons. So I need him in the front line with the big gun. Saint's probably gonna be a similar argument. It's interesting that they're over there. Yeah, they're probably just coming around by the time they finally patrolled through. Hank's in a good spot. I think my machine gun is in a good spot. My rocketeer is not, though. And I could put Hank just down here in the barrels. This would be a little e not saint. Damn it, I'm trying to select Hank. Might be able to get him in a good place. I mean, here would be okay too, I guess. It'd be corner cover. That's not too bad. And that wouldn't give him that wouldn't give him the uh, aliens so much elevated ground on us. Uh, it was gonna take him a little while to get over there. So that's not great. I may want to put him just here. I don't know. It's a difficult decision, because I want my Rocketeer to be able to go down this pipe if need be. I'm just going to dash Hank out there. Just get full cover from that. We got we only so much full cover to go around, so we got to kind of stick to the columns. And stick to the places that we've got solidified. Aye, aye. Thinking J-Ray is going to be instrumental getting this down. He's got the shred and floaters. They don't do so good with the rockets. They do good with grenades and just stay away from them, but rockets are a little harder for them. Going to get Moximus out here, I think. Uh, so you can toss a grenade aye, aye. and run to cover if need be. That'll probably work for me. Life, I mean, he's going to be useful no matter where I put him. But once those guys come through, he may need to break Overwatch at some point. I'm just going to leave Life in there. Um, yeah, I mean, we, we know where they are more or less. I'll pull Life out next. See if I can't take a peek of him without revealing myself too hard. I'm on my way. I want to keep my mech's mobility kind of flexible. So let me overwatch here, like that. Overwatch there, and I think that'll be okay. Is Leif the last one to move? Yeah, let's just let that one go. Okay, so we're gonna use Leif to scout this out a little more. Hopefully just run through here, take a peek, and then go to that side. Just what I'm aiming toward, I'm angling toward, actually. Hey, go right there, buddy, and give me a look-see. The stealth, it'll be useful, because there's nothing in this main area, those would've triggered it already. That's good. You could probably keep them running. Yeah, they're right out there, aren't they? And we're gonna keep this idea rolling. Maybe it wouldn't be bad to have full cover on this side on the columns and just be able to lock them down. That's probably a good idea, honestly. Jean can't quite get there though. He's like one tile away from getting there, which I'm not a fan of. If I don't move, eh. I could rush Leif there to see if he sees anything. Bien, oh, we don't have visual on anything yet. I'm gonna get Saint right out there. That may be okay, because he's a little tankier for the front line. Yeah, there'll go. Uh, Zhang, 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 Zhang. So we know that's relatively safe. I can move Zhang here. I am on it. We'll have Sentinel Overwatch, and we can always get him on that corner next turn. That's perfect. Then I can start shifting some of these power positions down, so they know where we're gonna be fighting from. Hank, get over here, and then we'll put you in that half cover in a second. I need my gunner over there. She'll step out on both sides of that column, so that'll be really useful. And I'll be blown into hell. She'll have what we need right there. Maybe getting Hank up there wouldn't be bad either, but the corner cover with the... Yeah, that'll probably be better off. And then that way we can get our Rocketeer where... I mean, he's still not a great spot for him. The Rocket's a pretty good range. Let's get... Dog 100, I guess. Position we drop him there instead. I mean, the first rocket's going to be what's going to count, so that's all right. We'll get Maximus down here, watching now. that side, and have another Overwatch available. Doesn't look like the floaters are out there, so I'm going to try to move my mech move. forward judiciously here, not trigger too much vision, and still have an availability for Overwatch should the case arise. So that's okay. Nothing is active yet. We want to hit him in a good spot. If we can hit him well, then we're going to be okay. 
Yeah, Overwatch, buddy, you're not going to be doing too much else. We are going to have to keep checking with Lake like we've been doing. Yeah, they're like right on the side of that, aren't they? All right, let's get Zhang in position. And we'll see if we can't use Leif to scout this out safely. I'm going. Enemy spotted. Oh, we got contact. It's kind of what I was afraid of. We got crap tons of evil coming in. And not a lot of room to maneuver. All right, now we got to start thinking, because this is going to be pretty nasty coming forward. i got to be careful with what we've got. Hang it over here. These all have grenades, too, which is part of the issue. I think we're just going to drop everybody a massive Overwatch party. Saint probably needs to get over here more than anything else, but his, his armor is going to slow him down a bit. I may want to get Saint just here, because if they dash forward, I'll be able to at least hunker up. And a lot of this is destructible, so I'm keeping guys back here. I actually may not do that at all. I am going to pull Leif here, though. So we'll have another set of Overwatch that we can possibly use. And then we're just going to kind of hope for the best, because this is going to get ugly before it gets better. I have the sinking feeling. All right, so who's where? So I'm not sure where they're going to be coming up on. You definitely do not have full cover, actually. But keep steadying that. I think I have a feeling I'm going to need that rocket. Maximus, I want to be able to move up and toss the smoke wherever it is required. So now it got real, and that looked like all heavy. Seven heavies. Oh, God. You know when I was paranoid and saying he's going to try to kill me? It's trying to kill me. That is brutal, dude. Seven heavies, and they're all going to be able to fly, too. So this is not going to be a lot of fun, what's about to happen. We're going to overwatch with everybody, and we're going to hope we can knock this down a bit. So Zhang has got a shot on that guy. Got nothing. Nothing. C'est pas vrai, c'est vrai. That's the problem. Okay, it's only one guy. Okay. John's got another shot. Good. Okay, if we can kind of keep baiting him in here, we can minimize their... the value of their flight, which is hard. Wow, nice shot. If Hank's got an eye on that. That's going to be really useful. God, I wish I had in the zone right now. All right, this is going to start getting messy in a second. Okay, good Hostile miss. Good miss. Morris has got that one down. Or, I mean, got a shot on him at least. Definitely doesn't have them down. This is going to be messy. The good thing about this is the way they're stacking up by that, I could probably get a grenade on a lot of them. So they're not that high off the ground. Armor has not been penetrated. Yeah, but you're about to get penetrated because absorption fields you do not have. Well, I'll keep bunching up like that. I want that shred and I want that grenade yesterday. Okay. This is the best chance we're going to have to get these guys down, so let's do it. Shred. I need that to go exactly where I'm telling you to. We're going to go through the building and we're going to hit all these guys. That's my plan. Can we not do this? Uh, not, no, we have a shot blocked. We have a shot is blocked warning on that one. So we cannot do the shred the way I want to. And that's just the limit of the rocket's range, I think. I just don't have the range on it. So we shred a little, but I think I need to focus on getting down what I can. I think what I also need to do is get a smoke up on our mech. This is going to get messy before it gets better. Let me get that grenade off right now, though. We can kill one of these guys and start doing some damage to more of them. And the more damage we do, the more executioner starts procking, and then we can do as about as perfect as I can ask for. Right in that corner, that's what I'm saying. They moved in to a point where their flight isn't quite as good. That's going to be critical for our strategy. I also have the sinking feeling of crap. I mean, that might have cleared up the rocket shot as well, too. That'd be awful, awful nice. Yeah, that may have cleared up the rocket shot a little. I'm going to take a look on that. Let's see. Uh, where's that rocket? There we go. I need that rocket. Can we do this now that we blew up a little bit of the cover? Oh, we can do a little more now. That's definitely true. Just not still... I mean, that shot right there would be so freaking gorgeous, but I can't hit it. Uh, oh, no. Uh, I'm getting, like, little bits and fragments and pieces of where I want to toss that rocket. Looks like those two in the back are going to be the prime suspects, prime candidates for, for suck. It's just that, that blocked shot is not going to go. I mean, if, this may still shred, though, it looks like. No, but shot blocked means it's not going to go where I want it to go. 
The rocket's still not going to be where I want it. All right, so I'm going to probably hold off on that. Hopefully, that's not going to get me killed. Uh, Lave, 80%. Yeah, the fact that he has Deadeye is going to be a huge help. Does Zhang have Deadeye, or do we remove that in the latest patch that changed all the promotions? Can we get a smoke here that'll cover our mech? Yes, we can. It'll cover Zhang, that'll cover our mech, and that'll cover Morris for the most part. I want to get that grenade kind of kind of right there. I'll make sure the mech gets it, because the mech's getting targeted. And I'm 90% certain some of those guys are going to have um, heat. Like that guy. No. Do you have heat? Heavy? No. 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 Let's see. 1%. Yeah, it's not looking too good. He doesn't have it. He doesn't have heavy. I mean, he doesn't have heat. Because heavies tend to come with heat. That's my, my major concern here. And that's usually a bad sign for health and sanity. You only got one shot. All right, well, we're definitely going to take that one, I guess. Let's try to double tap that bastard out. And squad sight means there's very low likelihood of, um, of Overwatch coming off. Nice. Nice. Okay. That guy may have covering fire granted, so we're going to have to take a bit of a risk with some of these guys. What do we have on Hank? 70% yeah, on that guy. 70. So 70. 80% on that guy. That's really good. 7% on that fellow. Okay, so we're going to have to start taking percentage shots on this. Holy crap, this is not fun. Uh, the question is, yeah, which one of these guys is covering fire? Are you on Overwatch? You don't appear to be on Overwatch. What's the other guy that sees you? That guy. Uh, does not have covering fire. So we can clear that fellow up, and then John can take another shot. So let me take that easy. I mean, easy is relative term. We can still miss a 94, but let's take that one. Yep, one down. One Another one down. Finished. How many still do we have? We still have five up. Jesus. Um, I had 74 there. That guy doesn't have a hollow up. Leif may be able to knock him down with an 80%, but Leif also has 80% on that guy. So, given that I have multiple shots and multiple targets, I'd rather... What does Hank have eyes on? Do I have eyes on all of these? That guy with the four hit points, that guy with that guy, and the guy that no one else sees. Okay. So... Uh, we gotta start picking off as many as we can here, and that's not, it's a lot easier said than done for heavy floaters, I gotta say, that's, that's no joke, these dudes are no, no fun. Alright, let me get Zhang to take that one shot he does have, I could Sentinel Overwatch with Zhang, and that may prove more useful, that's a good point actually, if I Sentinel Overwatch and they try to move in, I may be able to get more out of it, but the bottom line is, I think I need, I absolutely need to get smoke up, on our mech. That's going to be job one. If John gets it, great. But the mech's going to be important. I just don't want to give them too much smoke, so I'm going to probably drop it just like that. And then I'm going to get him to full cover, because I don't want them suddenly finding that I have some guys that are exposed. Uh, let me get you right. Uh -huh. Yeah, mind freight would be great too, but I don't have the flexibility for that right now. Okay. Yeah, the debate is right now whether I put Zhang on Sentinel Overwatch or not. And these guys are going to keep moving, so I think Sentinel Overwatch with Opportunist is going to be really useful. So I think I'm going to put Zhang on that. I'm just going to let Leif hopefully take that guy out. Yes. Yes, he did. So that's four left. And that's four left. And then Hank has a shot or three. And he's a shot. I won't be able to execute much. But it's worth the swing. Nice, Hank. Nice, Hank! Yes! Freaking yes. Okay. That's good. That's really good. You can tell because I'm getting excited. All right. Zhang, Sentinel Overwatch, buddy. Dog 100. Uh, I want him to steady, but if that dude rushes up on him, it's going to be bad. And I could be in the smoke, but not really. I mean, if he rushes up this way, he's going to take Zhang and Petrosi into the face. So I... Yeah, probably will be okay. I think we just got to drop overwatches here and be confident. Um, make sure no one can go in through that side. And you keep steadying. So they bunch up again, we'll shred. God, so stressful. There's so many of these guys. Our Zhang's at 64 Sentinel. He's moving left. Nice. They realized that corridor wasn't a good spot for them to stay. So they're trying to take advantage of their mobility a little more. You can stay flanked. That works for me. Zhang's got another ping on this guy. That's good. Zhang! God, Sentinel was a good choice. That was a good choice. I know you're running dry, buddy. You've been dropping 
heavy floaters like nobody's business right now. How many of these assholes do we have left? We have two left. Did we just annihilate five heavy floaters in like one turn? I think we did. Plus the Overwatch, so I guess that's one and a half turns. That's pretty badass. I need to keep an eye here in case they try to flank me. I don't want to let them do that. All right, it looks like... All right, Zhang is going to have to reload in Sentinel for obvious reasons. Because he doesn't have much else to do right now. And that's going to be useful. Dog 100, I mean, that rocket's still in in escrow, so to speak, I guess. Uh, let me get Leif here, because this is going to give him concealment, because nothing has vision on his movement. And we'll have better vision on what's coming oh, in that yeah. side. I'm going to rush him through. Maybe I'll peek that heavy. No. He may be going up high on us. So we got to be careful of that. Dog 100 especially. He's he's the fragile one right now. We're going to keep that stead weapon steadied. We're going to keep the faith that that'll work out. Lock down the major weapon. Mech is doing okay. So what I'm probably going to do is keep kind of trying to follow the floaters. Position confirmed. Um, so I can stay in the smoke and still utilize that big gun for fun and profit. Uh, Maximus... It may be worthwhile to start shifting him over as well over here to get support on that side. I think I may do that. Let me get Mox right here, and then we'll move left. All right, this should be the last pack of the mission besides the Outsiders, so I'm uh, feeling a little better about that. Hank, I say reload, and I say steady, so we have line on anything, especially if something comes down this pipe again. Yeah, there we go. That's why we stayed on Overwatch. That's why I moved my mech. Got him. I think the mech missed and everyone else connected. So the question is, where's the last guy? Alright. So I don't know where the last fellow is. The one who can figure this out for me is Leif. The danger of moving Leif up this far... I mean, here is better because that gives him full cover and that keeps him concealed. But if that thing breaks flank with him, I mean, flanks him, he's going to take a lot of damage. It won't kill him. But, I mean, at the risk of just... I don't want to Overwatch camp again, because that's no fun to watch. It's probably the safest thing I can do at this juncture. I mean, Zhang just locking this down Reloading with the Sentinel weapon. Overwatch, he's just been a blessing. I'm so glad I took uh, Sentinel infantry on this on this mission. I mean, yeah, it, like, this is what I'm saying. Like, the thing with mechs is, like, everyone's like, oh, mechs are so bad. Mechs are great. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love mechs. There's so much value to be had of the base classes, too, that... You know, Long will really did turn this into a very interesting experience, I must say. One hell of a set of uh, options that you have tactically. I'm getting Hank back here now, I've decided, since I can probably shoot down either pipe if I need to. I'm gonna get Hank out. out. Now, that dude still made jetpack, so I'm probably gonna keep my medic out here a spotter in case something goes really south. So I'm gonna likely keep him with his eyes out here in case that asshole jetpacked anywhere. These guys can jetpack, as we found out on the... Uh, on the base defense mission, those guys can jetpack without us knowing. Uh, so that's always a problem when they decide to realign like that. Then we'll have to maybe try to change the complete direction on how we're moving. Uh, don't want to get up here, so we need to potentially launch a rocket at a guy that jetpacked. Let's do this. We'll be available for it. Yeah, we're going to kind of keep an eye on Hank here while keeping the guys that are keeping the front locked down, well, locking it down after all. Let's keep moving a little bit leftwards. Moving out. So you have a line on everything. We just don't really want to have line on everything. There he is. Okay, he, he went back down that pipe. So I'm glad Hank's not here anymore. So Hank's going to have that, I think. 70. Can we hollow that? Not quite. All right. There's a double tap, though. Okay, two misses. It's okay. There's a lot of ammo in that gun, so I'm more or less okay with that. What does Zhang look like on his two shots? 94. Yeah, it's going to be pretty good. Hank, did you already get promoted, buddy? Oh, Hank already got his promotion. He's already Master Sergeant. Let's get Zhang this, because Zhang did not get promoted yet. He's still waiting for that promotion. Uh, he's one kill away. Well, let's hopefully get him that. There you go. It is dead. Got another Master Sergeant for our trouble. Okay. So... If my ears did not deceive me earlier, that was likely the last pack of the mission, uh, besides the Outsiders. So in case the Outsiders are patrolling, which they have been known to do, it's, it's, it's not usual behavior for Outsiders, but they have been known to do it. it. I'm going to keep people more or less still safe, but then we're going to send Leif in to do his scouting thing. 
and we're hopefully going to figure out where they're at so we can take them down and go home yeah, with all these alloys. That was the scariest pack of the bunch. The lid pack was a little scary because there's a lot of meat and I didn't bring enough shotguns for that. That one, though, with all those heavy floaters, good God, man! That was awful. Uh, but, you know, that's the way it goes sometimes. You get okay, nasty choices. And they're all dead now, so life is better. So Leif's going to be sprinting down here, keeping an eye on where the Outsiders may be at. Uh, Saint, I guess, can support him in that respect. We're just make sure, yeah, they're all dead. 40 aliens killed, hey, we're still not done with the mission. It's a big mission. This is a big mission. It is also possible the Outsiders are not in the UFO, which would be a unique but not unusual situation. Sometimes they spawn outside it, and you have to be careful of that, because you may get caught in a bad way if you're not expecting them to do that little devious thing. Uh, but it looks like nothing is out here, so I'm going to keep rushing in. Take this nice and slow as we make our way through the UFO. Make sure we do not get killed for our trouble. Ammunition loaded. Locked up. Hank's already fully loaded, so I'm kind of feeling... I'm feeling like just overwatching, I guess. I mean, not going to be much on the overwatch there. Ray, why don't you do that too? J-Ray, sorry. Not Ray. Ray's our medic. Again, nothing in the vicinity. Which likely means the outsider pack is somewhere... Probably... Oh, wait. This is the end of the UFO, more or less. Yeah, that's the... That's the kind of, like, deployment bay... They're probably sitting in this base somewhere. And I don't want Leif to to trigger them until I'm damn well ready. I just gotta keep moving between full cover to full cover. There's no guarantee though that where I move won't be flankable unless I keep sitting down this direction. So we're gonna have to keep an eye on where these dudes are at. Um, there's no way I can get flanked from here, right? Unless they're sitting right there, which we know they're not because we already rushed in. So we're just going to keep dancing this way, keeping out of sight. Okay, je bouge. Oh god, and we got flanked, didn't we? Holy crap. We didn't get flanked? I think we may have gotten flanked. That is... That, my friends, is crappy. Because Leif is going to get revealed now, and all hell will break loose. Well, on the upshot... We know where the proxies need to go. Just when I said, you know, I was like, oh, this probably be okay. Oh, that's the one place that I couldn't stand, huh? That's exactly where they are. That's five outsiders in the Thin Man, which seems to be a pretty decent compliment for UFOs this size. Well, let's see what we can do with this. I don't even know, man. I don't even know what we can do with this. Uh, shit balls. All right, well, we know we won't have vision here. So let's start getting people in the corners that we need to get them in. Oh, Hank, get on that corner and steady up. Uh, let me get... Oh, God. We're going to need to really catch up on support here. This is going to get messy. All right. Manana needs well, to get there. Us. We're not going to have a lot of ammunition for the suppression, though, so that's going to be a problem. Oh, uh, God. Leif's going to get revealed, isn't he? It's not good. It's really not good. It's not what I wanted to see right now. Yeah. Because there's not a lot Understood. of good, good vision lines here, either. They're kind of in a low position. Uh, Dog 100, where can I put your rocket right now? I want to kind of put it where Hank is, but Hank needs to shoot as well. Hank can technically move up here and shoot, so he could also get out there. I can't really get out there. I think I need to put Dog 100 in that corner now. The circumstances force me to do so. I mean, this won't put Hank in a great spot, but it'll put him in a spot that's still relatively safe I'm on it, from man. most threats. And now let me get my Rocketeer in this corner. I mean, he won't be steady, but at least he'll be able to get the shred where we need to go. The question is, should I knock that proxy right now? Because if it reveals them, Position confirmed. you know, later, and they get a move because of that proxy, then Leif is dead. Which I cannot have on my conscience. Not in good faith. So let me get over here. Yes, Saint. Then I'll have to see what the hell happens, because I, I won't even know where these guys go, pretty much. Uh, you seen for now Overwatch, I guess. In case stuff runs out. Maximus, yeah, this this whole um, concealment thing works weird sometimes. But let's see. What's happening? What the hell? 
they didn't see Leif. I guess they have to move for that to happen. That's new information for me. I never knew that, actually. Oh, that worked out way better than I thought. Holy crap. Um, damn, okay, that worked out much better than I had possibly expected it to work out. Okay, so we have a chance, I guess, to reload on Morris. Um, we do have to start annihilating some of these fools, though, because with the proxy, it's not going to kill any of them. Do we actually have vision on what these dudes are? That's pretty amazing. What are you? Outsider, standard outsider. You are standard outsider. You are commander. Opportunist ready for anything, lightning reflexes, close combat. So this guy's got everything, sentinel and damage control. He's the scary one. You are standard outsider. So there's one big commander I need to worry about. There seem to be any other special ones. And we got that damn thin man. Uh, but he's not a sniper, so... Okay. So I can't move Leif out of here without triggering all hell breaking loose. I may need the assistance. Uh, I wish I had a high explosive rocket still. That would be really nice. We can definitely get a shredder up here if they, if they jump up. And they won't know I'm here for the most part. Oh, this is not terrible. I mean, I have to kind of take the initiative. They're never going to be bunched up like this for proxy pretty much ever again. I would love to have Morris reloading. And could I wait a turn and Leif not get revealed? If he didn't get revealed this turn, he probably won't next turn. So let me set this up just a little better, I guess. I mean, this is like pushing my luck in a big way. Okay, Gatova. All right, we're gonna toss that there. Zhang is ready on the corner. Saint's ready to rush in and cover stuff. I mean, this is going to be brutal, brutal close quarters fighting, and oh, Hank, I don't know if this is going to screw Hank over, because I think I need to get him on a better angle than this. Right now I have eyes, this is where the big guy is. I need to have eyes on this corner. I don't think I'll visualize anything from here, because that way I can get on this corner and maybe even get corner cover later. It's going to be safe for Hank all around. Okay. Okay, this is so freaking tense right now. You have no idea. Actually, you probably do have an idea. You hear me, like, humping and moaning in a really weird way. Um, all right, these guys get moving. I can get a rocket down. We're going to actually get a rocket down, too. I can get a rocket down to there. So I can get a rocket pretty much where I want it as long as I steady. So if this holds the way I hope it will, I'll be ready to go next turn. We'll have the element of surprise, thanks to Leif. John can reload. Ready to engage. I'm, I'm going to need every last ounce of ammunition. Uh, Leif's not going to do anything. Saint's ready. Well, let's get Saint a little closer as he's ready to breach even easier, I think. Okay, good. Uh, and Hank. Yeah, you're going to be able to move in here and then do your work pretty much. That's pretty much good as far as I'm concerned. All right, let's get Hank up there. I guess you can overwatch in case something goes really badly. Leif do nothing. Okay, he's doing that. And Leif is still concealed by some small freaking miracle. Okay, I still learned a little bit more about how concealment works, so that's always good. It's a learning experience. Alright, time to proxy this shit and figure out how to do it. Um, I'm gonna one for all, so we can obviously use this as cover if cover absolutely necessary. Here. Then we're gonna proxy the big guy, and this is gonna activate the pack, and it's gonna go off because Leif has vision of them. It's kind of a double whammy where I come from. Uh, so let's get that done. They'll have less cover this way, and I need to get that proxy right in that dude's face. Right there. Yes. And he's dead, it'll be better for everyone. Placing proximity mine. Hi. Cleared to engage. Okay, that didn't do anywhere near the amount of damage I needed it to. There's gonna be a lot of flanks here. Okay, where are they flanking from? That guy's right there. That's kind of funny. Alright, so we didn't do anywhere near as much damage as that guy has had, and nothing is dead, it would seem. Oh no, we got... No, we got nothing killed. Did a lot of damage to a bunch of stuff, so that's good. The rocket is not great, because uh, they moved, so our spread's less good. Hank's in a bad spot. Samir's in a not great spot. I gotta get Hank out. 
uh, for obvious reasons. This dude back here picked a really weird place to sit, I gotta say. Saint's gonna have a lot of work cut out for him here, I have this feeling. There's gonna be a lot of door-to-door, house-to-house, door-knocking kind of stuff going on. Probably, I'm gonna see if I can get this guy dead with one go. Because if that's the case, then we have a little more flexibility on our options. He, wait, you have cover? Oh, this isn't a flank for you? Oh, that would have been really shitty had I realized that. That wouldn't have given me hit and run because my mech is in, in uh, they can use my mech as cover. I guess they can use it just like they can use shivs. That's annoying as all hell. And putting Saint there is going to get him killed. Well, that's a clever little outsider. All right, I'm going to put Saint back there. So I got to get the hit and run. Yes, there we go. That's what I was looking for. That would have been really, really tragic, actually. Hi. Okay, now we have the hit and run good. So, Saint is still flanked, which I cannot abide. We'll be able to get this down a little better. Leif is going to have to probably charge up... I don't know, where's a safe corner for him? This is probably a safe corner for him, because anything here is going to get flanked otherwise. So we can knock some of this down. I can even... I mean, blowing a shredder to kill one of these guys is going to be totally fine by me, honestly. Uh, Zhang has shots on a lot of stuff here. 67 twice something I can do it. So the problem is the big guy's not dead. That's That was my biggest goal early on, and I, I'm not going to be able to do it. But I do have a Gauss machine gun. I can do work on a couple things. I could try and double up on that guy, or we can double up in the fun with that guy. How is she flanked is my question. What is she flanked by? That guy can't be flanking her, because that's the other side of the door. We're accounting for all enemies. So he should not be flanking Morris. Why is he flanking her? Because he's not flanking... I don't think she's actually being flanked. I think it may be an artifact, because she hasn't moved yet. It doesn't make any sense. Um, technologically speaking. Yeah, Leif can get an easy kill there, but that puts him in a really bad way. And I have to kind of put Leif here. Which is not optimal, because these guys are all going to regen, and the Thin Man's going to regen, so that's kind of shit all over the place. But we can get at least Hollow here. Nice shot. It'll more or less confirm... Probably confirm, nearly confirm a kill. I may drop some smoke back here to make this easier on everybody. With Samir just over here. It's probably a smart idea. Leif's going to be a little hung out. But this is going to let me get Hank back here. Alright, that's my plan. I don't think I can mine for any of these guys. Yeah, they're... They're they're mechanical, so... Copy that. Samir, get over here. Give me a smoke grenade up in this hizzy. Mainly because the outsiders shouldn't, shouldn't be getting the benefit of this. If they're on the other side of the door, it's going to suck. I'm going to try to get the smoke kind of... Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to let the outsider get the benefit of this. They come to the other side of the door. They're gonna have an easy time breaching. Yeah, I don't want them to get. I don't want to get them the smoke. I don't want to give them the smoke. So let's see how much we can annihilate before we have to commit to anything in particular. So Hank, get out of there because you obviously need to get the hell out of here. Roger that. That was obviously not where I expected that guy to move. But 68%. That's not bad. I think Zhang has about the same, and Zhang has more targets to potentially fire at. 77. All right, well, let's take that Hank shot, because otherwise Hank's not going to be able to take anything. Let's go. Nice. All right. So how many is that now? We have three outsiders, including the Big Daddy, and then the Thin Man. I'm surprised that that guy somehow is still reading flank in my book. It's really bizarre. Because I, sh I mean, this is cover, right? This is actually a full cover wall. I mean, uh, do I trust the game to be truthful to its own mechanics? Answer to that's a resounding freaking no, but... Okay, good. I'm going to probably try to suppress that fellow with Morris to make things easier. Uh, Zhang, you're going to overwatch with Sentinel because you have two shots that way. Dog 100, keep steadying that rocket because I have this feeling I'm going to need it at some point. Morris, I'm not I'm not content with where she's sitting right now, but I don't think I have much choice. Petrosian, uh, that guy's going to come from that side. So putting Petrosian, oh, that's a flank. 
Flank from freaking where? If, if this, this wall is not reading as actually there, I guess. These are all flanked positions, so that really kind of sucks because that's not how the game works. But okay, I have to go here because otherwise... Oh no, so it's actually full cover until she moved. So that was an artifact that pretty much screwed me. Uh, okay, that's not good. So we're going to have to hunker with Morris. That is freaking stupid. Saint, I'm going to put Saint up here, not as a sacrificial lamb, but he is so freaking tanky right now that I want, if something's going to shoot him and try to move in through the door, I want him to have to... Okay, why is that a flank now? It wasn't a flank a second ago. All right. This is weird. Uh, what the hell? All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bias the smoke to this side. What is going on? I don't understand. I really don't understand what's going on right now. What is going on right now? Systems within okay, mech's parameters. fine, but she got hit. She's getting a little low on health, though. Sentinel Overwatch. Yeah, it looks like they're hitting. Like, it's just, uh... Okay, so that's really weird. So that, that wall is not actually a wall. I suppose that's the lesson here. When is a wall not a wall? When the game tells you it's not a wall. That's really freaking annoying. We don't seem to be able to find an easy way to break the Overwatch here. So I gotta get Saint out of there, otherwise he's gonna start pushing up daisies. Alright, what can we do to clear this up a little? Wow, this is all kinds of weird right now. So much for hoping the game would cover its own. Um, I do want that right there. I can't force him to move though, but that proxy's gonna be sitting there until we find a good way to use it. Proximity if he goes anywhere, he's gonna take a proxy to the face. Wow. I don't know. I don't know the answer to this question, how to resolve it, because this is becoming concerning. Um, hmm. Okay. Leif, can you break that Overwatch for me? He has Sentinel, remember, so that can be a perfect solution, but if I can just... There's that Lightning Reflexes. Found the other guy. Leif can maybe get this guy down with it with a combination of Shred and some movement. Oh, that guy's still in cover. He's got that little corner ass thing that he's doing. But Leif's in cover, right? I mean, this looks like cover. The cover on this particular map is driving me insane. I need to start doing this. This, this guy of covering fire does not appear to. Okay. So I kind of need to do more damage to him. Maximus. So what do we still have? We have the Thin Man. In the alien, so Saint's gonna have to move. But the problem is, Saint is currently covered by that guy, who apparently has Saint flanked. That is screwed up. You know who may actually have a shot on this? If I put Hank here, he may have a shot on that guy. Because this is way too far for the Overwatch to connect, because Leif ran, and it was okay. Oh, Hank, 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 you, you can't do this to me, man. I need you to be able to get there. Well, let me... Tactical options, man. Really limited here. They're in here, but I'm a little low on health to the point that I'm not comfortable just sitting here <coughs> taking prods on this guy. Uh, I mean, I could just volume of fire this crap, and Leif's got a lot of volume of fire to spare. 63 with a hollow, that means all four shots. I mean, the likelihood of missing every single one of these is low, and if we can get that major threat down, we can at least do something. And if he sits there and he realizes that it's difficult to get out of there, we may be able to pull this off. All right. Uh, let's... I think Double Tap may be off the record here. Did we Double Tap last turn? Crap. Does, have, does she have Double Tap active? Double Tap available. Okay, it is available. So, how about, let's make that not like the wall here. That's actually a double tap. Functional. No, not there. Double tap. Come on. Okay, there's a hit. So, I was already... So, missing two 40% shots in a row is about 16%. We missed two, and then, so... There was a 14% chance of that happening. So, my odds were okay. It's just... 
They're not connecting for us. Oh, come on. If I ever needed you to hit Zhang, I really need you to hit that executioner that. Oh, come on, buddy. 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 Are you kidding me? Okay. Problem with this freaking crap is that I have absolutely no way to deal with it. I was counting on. Oh, Saint's gonna get butchered. Holy shit. Saint's gonna get annihilated if he sits there. If he moves, he's gonna get shot too. My only hope is to get a rocket in there somehow, but I don't think I can on that angle that I'm sitting on right now. Stop that. If it was a high explosive rocket, I may be able to. And we already learned we can't set off proxies with shredders to my everlasting regret. Oh, God, that dude can absorb so much punishment. He had just enough hit points to get out of there. I think I may need to do this with Dog 100. Just get in here. Oh, now he has eyes on this. All right, you're going to you're gonna hunker, buddy. Hank, I need you to come Ready here. Now. And the answer is, no, Commander, I don't have a shot on that dirt bag. Not yet. All right, let's laser pistol Overwatch. If I had snapshot, this may be viable. As it stands, it's kind of not. I need to hunker, though. Otherwise, he's going to be able to rush up on me. Samir needs to cover this a little. I need to get Saint out of there, but getting Saint out of there is going to require running Overwatch, so I need to dash. I need to dash in a big way. And I can't. I can't take two Overwatches. It's just going to kill him. And if I move here, then it's also a problem. So it's the only safe dash is over here. That the fact that that somehow is not cover blows my mind. That I'm taking so much injury for it. The problem is this guy totally has me locked down. I'm going to take Opportunist to the face, and I can't be crit, but that's going to put Saint down in actual health mode. I'm going to have to put Saint out here, I think. Have Samir ministered, and no, I can't take both. I'm trying to avoid that, damn it. Uh, where can I put him? Every, I mean, his movement is just good enough that I can't do this. And that's going to take two shots of Overwatch. I need to just basically duck him away. And there's no good place to duck him away to. God damn it. No, it's going to force him into a bad position. This should be okay, but this is just so bad. I do not want to make this move right now. I mean, I could possibly command and hope the last shot connects, but... If I don't, Saint's going to be annihilated by everything. Yeah, it's going to be opportunist. He's going to connect. Please don't do it twice. Oh, thank God he missed. What I'm hoping is going to happen is that guy's going to realize his bad position, and maybe he'll move. Oh, no, he was going to fire. I missed the mech, thankfully, because of the smoke. He's going to pop up and try to flank. Yeah. He's going to flank. Nice shot, but he's going to flank Leif, I think. Yeah, shit. Shit. Okay, five. That's okay. He didn't crit, at least. Oh, I see Saint. Oh, God. Oh, that's a lot worse. That's a lot worse. Okay, that fucking sucks. And he's back! Okay. The fact we can't use that wall is really screwing us right now. And the fact that Hank is out here this badly is not good. Sink, can you come up and clear this up for me? I don't think Sink can even do this with all the power he can muster. So that shred is going to have to take the big boss out because he's just sitting there. He's going to be ready for anything and be good to go. Hank can get cover, but he took seven. I mean, luckily that was all armor damage. Saints in a bad way, too, right now. God, everything is just not coming up roses right now. This is really awful. What I need to do... I mean, that thin man... Are we... Are you actually suppressed? There, Leif? 
Yeah, you are suppressed. It doesn't freaking look like you're suppressed, though. Alright, I don't particularly care about the Thin Man Suppression, because Leif still has a 98% chance to hit this guy and a 60% chance to crit, so I'm okay with this. Oh, but there's a lot of problems with this game. I may try to reload this... Not go back, but... Reload this to line up with what I expect the things to happen. I may just finish up next time, guys. Sorry, I know I'm leaving you on a cliffhanger, but... Like, this is not cover, and that's not cover from people that are over there. I don't know what's going on with this game. So I gotta be a little careful. I'm gonna reload the mission, and I'm gonna finish it up next time. So I've been Urs. I'll see you all next time. Till then.